Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how to use the impulse equation. Now remember, impulse is the change in an object's momentum. And the change in an object's momentum, its impulse, is equal to the amount of force applied times the amount of time that force was applied for. So let's just say we have a rocket in outer space. Let's draw a little bit of space, some stars, a planet. All right, great. Now what happens is right now its momentum is zero. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to delta its momentum a little bit by turning on the thrusters. And when we turn on the thrusters, by golly, Newton's third law is going to do its thing. And what's going to happen is uh, we are going to generate some force for a certain amount of time and change its momentum a bit. So let's just say that the amount of force acting on the rocket from thrust is 4,000 newtons of force and that the rocket has a mass of 200 kilograms. And here's what we want to know. How, how long will it take to get from 0 to 60 meters per second? Well, all we have to do then is apply the equation up above. What we know here is, first of all, I like to always say, first thing you got to do is ask yourself what you're looking for. How long will it take? That, my friends, is time. We're trying to solve for time. Let's see what other variables we have. Kilograms, that measures mass. Meters per second, that measures velocity. So let's just go ahead and do this then. We're going to say 200 kilograms times 60 meters per second is going to equal the amount of force, which remember force is measured in newtons, so we're going to say 4,000 newtons times the time. Now, to solve for time, all we have to do is divide both sides by 4,000 newtons. Let me shrink this a little bit here. So what we're going to do now is we're going to say uh, 200 times 60, that's going to give us uh, let's see, well, what is that, Samson? That's 12,000 kilogram meters per second divided by 4,000 newtons equals the time. And that means the time, in this case, equals 3 seconds.